Okay, when it comes to these QFI, and these are the like 300 megabit uh, versions, um, yeah, I was having a lot of problems, uh, starting with when I tried to turn off the Wi-Fi on this, you know, host unit, um, because evidently this has got to be left in Wi-Fi mode, even though it's like, I don't need Wi-Fi, I've already got Wi-Fi over here on my router, you know, so I wanted to turn Wi-Fi off, I didn't think it was actually using Wi-Fi to communicate with the client, but it is, so... Um, but at any rate, yeah, all hell breaks loose, you know, you have a hard time, um, logging back into these damn things, but I mean, but the, the secret to how to reset this thing back to factory defaults is you gotta hold the reset button in, you know, until the thing starts swirling around, which is like 10 seconds, um, you know, and do it on both of them at the same time, uh, but then right after they're done resetting, you should press the button again, you know, briefly so that it resyncs because remember everything's being put back to factory default but it's not synced yet so you know so you got to sync them again that's what was confusing me um and the other thing you got to watch out for is when trying to log into these friggin things um you know on you know microsoft's little you know this thing here you know, if you go into properties, okay, and then, you know, and to set your, you know, 192, or, uh, 168, 188, you know, like 1 or 22 or whatever you want to put the address of this computer, be sure to, you know, every time you make a change, you know, not only hit OK, but hit OK here, otherwise it doesn't apply. So that was causing me a lot of confusion too. But anyway, right, I have a feeling that the ones that uh, I sent back probably were okay actually i hadn't sent them back yet but um you know but that's probably what i was doing wrong with them but at any rate uh, it seems to be you know um good now um so like i said you know these things get pretty good you know throughput so you know way better than the other system i had which, you know, is pretty good, you know, using that antenna right there and, and that uh, TP-Link uh, um, external access point. Because that system worked. I mean, it was impressive as hell, too, uh, from my perspective. But, yeah, it was this... You know, it was this antenna here, you know, which is a directional antenna coupled with this TP link, you know, that I have hooked to it. Um, and this is a pretty neat device, but you know, on its own, it doesn't go more than about 60 feet or so. We should put that antenna in. I, you know, I reached, you know, half a block away uh, with it. Uh, but the secret to it was not, you know, on its own, it didn't do very good. You know, it was maybe a hundred feet if you're lucky, but you know, the key to it was combining it with, um, yeah, one of these little things. And this is like a 7200 uh, square foot um, range extender. And, you know, and it's programmable so you can log into it. And you can actually set these up as access points too, I found out. But at any rate, this was key, because without this, I couldn't have reached, you know, that, like, 200-foot distance or so, you know. Uh, I have no idea how much further it would have gone, but that's going through a house. I mean, a whole house was in between where I set this antenna up, you know, and which I just casually set it up out there uh, just to do some casual tests, you know, versus clear across the street, the house clear across the street, because I'm on the alley back here. So, I mean, yeah, that's a good 200 feet over there and going through a whole house. Uh, but, yeah, it still communicated. So, that was an impressive deal. The problem was, is the speed on this thing maxes out, um, you know, now that TP link at 30 megabit per second. So, um, you know, and that's even if it's like right next to the PC, you know, like three feet away from it. You, know, you can only get 30 megabit no matter what. 
um, where's this thing you know will do you know going close to a hundred you know uh, eight, 90 or 100 megabit so so anyway that's why this is a superior thing but I still haven't fully tested because I haven't tested this in the same way yet um, it's just been raining too much for me to want to mess with it um, but I got to run the same test or to set this outside my door and go see if I can pick it up across the street because otherwise you know this is superior you know um, but I don't know Anyway, 